All right, today we are continuing on with our gold medal tips about the balance beam. Today we are talking about where do we look? Where do we look when we're on the beam? What do we focus on? Now, most of the time you've probably heard your coach yell, head up, head up. Well, your coach doesn't want you looking down at the beam like this, all bent over. But he also doesn't want you looking straight up in the air so that you can't see the beam and where you're walking. So the things that I like to remember when I'm on the balance beam, chin level. I like when your chin is level because you can still see the balance beam. Doesn't matter where you are on the beam, if your chin is level, you can see it. You know where you're stepping and that's a really good thing. So you want to make sure you can always see the beam. Keep your eyes at a 45 degree angle. Keep that chin level so you do look confident and then you feel confident. Now the other part of that is when you keep your eyes on the beam, you're not looking around, waving to mom and dad. And it's all well and good when you're at your gym. But what happens when you go to compete? The scenery changes completely. You're at a new gym, you're at a new facility, you might be in an arena. So all of a sudden you're staring at a floor exercise routine being done by another athlete. Or maybe you're looking at an audience and people are taking flash photography and waving signs. That's going to knock you right off the beam. So focus on the balance beam. When you keep your eyes on the beam, the scenery never changes. All right, so remember, chin level, eyes on the beam. I know this is going to help you during practice, but most importantly, it's going to help you stay on the beam during a competition. Thanks so much for tuning in today. And for even more gymnastics how-to videos, make sure that you hit subscribe. And if you want to keep up with everything Shannon Miller, make sure to follow me on all my social media channels.